Several Eastern European countries like Poland, Bulgaria, and Slovakia retain dozens of Russian-made aircraft in their inventories and have been hesitant to give up those planes without guarantees from the US that they could replace them. Poland has been modernizing its aircraft fleet since 2006, when it first started flying F-16s, and in 2020 signed a $4.6 billion deal for 32 F-35s, the first of which will arrive in 2024, making those older Russian-made planes expendable. This is why the F-16 is the best choice for Poland. According to the Polish Defense Minister Marius Blaszczak Poland discussed a purchase of Lockheed Martin F-16 fighter jets with the US but the manufacturer, Lockheed Martin, was unable to deliver the aircraft on such short notice, leading Poland to select the Korean Aerospace Industries, KAI, F-A-50 light attack aircraft. It's worth noting that even Lockheed Martin has also offered the latest variant of the F-16, Block 70, as well as the F-16V upgrade package for the existing fleet of the Polish F-16s. The F-16V package offers the same standard of equipment as the Block 70. The F-16 Block 7070 seconds is another option for the Polish Air Force. These fourth-generation fighters have been integrated with various modern systems which were designed based on the experience gained in the F-35 program. The new systems for the F-16 Block 7070 seconds include an active electronically scanned array, ESA, the latest electronic warfare systems, as well as modern avionics enhancing pilots' situational awareness. The new variant of the F-16 will be an interesting option particularly for less wealthy nations who cannot afford the F-35 but are still willing to acquire a brand new fighter. So far, the F-16 Block 70 has been purchased by Bahrain and selected as a new type of aircraft for the Slovak Air Force. On the other hand, several other countries decided to upgrade their F-16 fleet, Greece and Taiwan, for example. The F-16 seems an attractive solution for the Polish Air Force given that the existing infrastructure is compatible with the F-16 CD Block 52+. Furthermore, Polish pilots and aircraft technicians are familiar with this construction whose obvious advantage is also a relatively lower operating cost compared to other types of aircraft. The F-16 Fighting Falcon is a compact, multi-role fighter aircraft. It is highly maneuverable and has proven itself in air-to-air -air combat and air-to-surface attack. It provides a relatively low-cost, high-performance weapon system for the United States and allied nations. In an air combat role, the F-16's maneuverability and combat radius, distance it can fly to enter air combat, stay, fight, and return, exceed that of all potential threat fighter aircraft. It can locate targets in all weather conditions and detect low-flying aircraft in radar ground clutter. In an air-to-surface role, the F-16 can fly more than 500 miles, 860 kilometers, deliver its weapons with superior accuracy, defend itself against enemy aircraft, and return to its starting point. An all-weather capability allows it to accurately deliver ordnance during non-visual bombing conditions. In designing the F-16, advanced aerospace science and proven reliable systems from other aircraft such as the F-15 and F-111 were selected.
These were combined to simplify the airplane and reduce its size, purchase price, maintenance costs and weight. The light weight of the fuselage is achieved without reducing its strength. With a full load of internal fuel, the F-16 can withstand up to 9 Gs, 9 times the force of gravity, which exceeds the capability of other current fighter aircraft. The pilot has excellent flight control of the F-16 through its fly-by-wire system. Electrical wires relay commands, replacing the usual cables and linkage controls. Avionics systems include a highly accurate enhanced global positioning and inertial navigation systems, or EGI, in which computers provide steering information to the pilot. On the other hand, according to the statements of Poland's senior military officials the Lockheed Martin F-35A is considered the future aircraft of the Polish Air Force. The F-35 program has been significantly delayed, and the current price per unit remains at a relatively high level. Although the F-35 aircraft is not as expensive as it used to be couple years ago, the current estimated unit cost is about $89 MLN. All these challenges and high costs of maintenance result from an innovative approach to the aircraft construction and the technological advancement of the program that caused a significant delay in full rate production. Lockheed Martin set a goal of producing 15 aircraft a month. Currently, however, the company can build up to eight fighters a month. Even though Lockheed Martin is still far from achieving its target output, the current rate of production is still quite impressive given that other Western producers can produce from one to three fighters a month. Achieving the full rate production is necessary to reduce the unit and the maintenance cost of the F-35A. In 2023, the number of all F-35 in service is expected to reach 1,000 fighters, Lockheed Martin has produced 300 aircraft to date. However, the cost per hour of operating the F-35 is approximately $42,000 compared to approximately $20,000 for the F-16C. For the sake of comparison, it is worth noting that the cost per hour of a heavy twin-engine F-15 averages $27,000.